There's no way we're actually going to kill Sylvanas in the new raid. If we actually do officially kill her, I am quitting Retail WoW and only playing Classic. I don't know what it is, but whenever I have Sylvanas tear marks on my face, I just feel so much more like myself. Like, I would get this as a tattoo, but I just don't think society could handle it. Yeah, no, Sylvanas isn't just an aesthetic, it's like a lifestyle, you know? So like, my favorite quest line is the one where you're questing a Windrunner Spire and then it can drop the Dark Lady's necklace and you get to go turn it into Sylvanas in Undercity and then she sings the Lament of the Highborn, like that is my favorite quest ever. If I won the lottery, the first thing that I would do is build like a giant statue of Sylvanas in front of my house, kind of like the one that's in Brill in Tears Fall Glades, that would be so cool. I just think that a lot of people don't realize when she said this world is a prison, she literally meant it. Like if you look at the cosmology map, there's like domination runes around reality and there's also chains around death, so I think it's actually a prison. Okay, but like out of all the YouTubers that make WoW speculation videos, Akalon is definitely the best because he also simps for Sylvanas. I just feel like the people that don't like Sylvanas just don't know her lore well enough and don't understand what she's actually doing. So I have this like Sylvanas shrine thing and I just feel like it's not big enough. I would definitely say that my favorite World of Warcraft books are Shadows Rising, Before the Storm, War Crimes, and Arthas because you get to see some of Sylvanas' perspective and it's so amazing and I cannot believe that they're coming out with a full on Sylvanas book with the voice actor Patty Matson, like I'm freaking out. I just really like Sylvanas because she's helped me deal with a lot of my traumas throughout my life and helped get me through so many things and I just really relate to her story. Is it bad that I spent $2,000 on a commissioned Sylvanas cosplay? So you know how they have that thing in Sick Kids Hospital where if you're like dying you can have someone famous come and see you like Superman or Captain Jack Sparrow? If I was in Sick Kids Hospital I would definitely want Patty Matson to come and tell me that I'm nothing before I die. I feel like Sylvanas' story is so much bigger than the World of Warcraft universe can handle that I feel like Blizzard should actually just make an entire game about Sylvanas and I would totally play it. This one time my ex literally threatened to break up with me because he said I was too obsessed with Sylvanas and he was concerned for my mental health because I thought that she was real. We're not together anymore. Yeah, so I have a tattoo of Sylvanas on my arm and the Icon of Torment on my back and also Dark Lady on my fingers and I feel like I need so many more Sylvanas tattoos. I have so many ideas. I could just cover my body in her. Okay, but there's no way we're actually gonna kill her in the new raid. We didn't kill Jaina, we didn't kill Ashara, and they were also Warbringers, so I definitely don't think that this is the end of Sylvanas. Do you guys like my outfit? I'm wearing a Sylvanas shirt and Sylvanas leggings and I'm just really feeling myself. I feel so bad about Teldrassil and I love Night Elves, but it all comes down to being a Sylvanas loyalist and trusting in her end game. I don't know, it's just like my whole life I've always gravitated towards villainous evil characters, you know? I cannot wait for the Sylvanas book to come out on November 9th and the audiobook with Patty Matson. Oh my god, I'm gonna listen to that shit over and over again and go to sleep with it on. Do you think it would be weird if I played the Lament of the Highborn at my wedding? I just feel like people who don't like Sylvanas just don't really understand her story or what her motives are. Like, come on guys, she's playing 4D chess. I just really hope that they do something for the Sylvanas loyalists in Shadowlands, maybe in 9.1, because I just really hate that they kind of left us hanging in BFA and it's like, hey, I was a loyalist the whole time, like, why can't I continue to be? So I dyed my hair half black, half purple because I felt like that was kind of Sylvanas' colors, but sometimes I just really miss my silver hair to like fully embody her, you know? So I have like three different Sylvanas custom phone cases, but I think I might order another one soon. Oh my god, my other favorite quest line is the one where you get to like quest with her in Silver Pine Forest and like you get to run with her and she tells you her whole story and I just feel like I am having such a personal moment with her. I love it. Oh yeah, religion. I worship Sylvanas. 